Hi, a happy new year to all of you. My name is Miss Jean. I'm here because a conversation, a voice note for that matter. That yes, inti um any video we na na e pese ye bo inti se se no die ye be bo video na nkasa we die. Yeah, but can watch him. And no, a a a a later later vibe. So what he has here. But watch this particular video. Eh, just watch it. Okay. Um, inti um, I'm say video na kasa eh baby a shano eh wa. He did far. He did far. So you dear, we could just carry on on that one. Okay. Um, there's this whole issue with uh, Titi. Someone we need Titi. Ono akampo oba legend so oba a jingu. On near jingle bed, to chit to and then you know about how he's suffering and uh, um, the things that has been happening to him as a veteran actor. If you don't know TT, taxi driver, TT, you should know TT by now. Aha. Uh -huh. So he has been trending all up and down. But now saying, yeah, a trend, they say, um, say, audio be by out, say, uh, not of fret, Miss G. Miss G happens to be one of the renowned, you know, um, entertainment, you know, pandist. Our friend on our catch and say, um, oh, he had left Uvers because they say an idiot. Hmm. Uh, I'm saying, in your ma, in your ma, you're doing kakama, no. And leftovers from the her kitchen. Precisely. Leftovers from her kitchen. And now, uh, I mean, he, he, him did mention that people had donated to him. Of course, the vice president also donated to him. But for the year, a investment. But the higher investment in tea, um, that is it. But um, I'm say there's a and there's another video. Let's 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 go listen to the the audio itself and also Miss G explaining herself too as well. You know, yeah. So let's just watch it. Hi, a happy new year to all of you. My name is Miss G. I'm here because a conversation, a voice note for that matter, that has my name in there has gone viral. Now, if you follow my works, you know me, you know that when I do interviews um, and there's backlash, people call me out, people have reservations and they voice them out. I never come to defend myself. I never even come to respond to most of them. I just do not think is necessary because I feel like it's the hazard that comes with the job that we do. Maybe it's the reason it's taking me quite a while to respond to this voice notes saga. Let's go back to 2001 when I got products from some sponsors. I went all the way to Dodua and even beyond to look for TT. I donated these items or those items to him. I sat with him for a conversation. It was during that interview that he told me that he had heart disease. He had a heart disease and needed help. I put the information out there. Subsequently, I came to you right here on social media to appeal for funds for him. Put his number out there, of course, with his permission. And because you do not know what conversations have gone on behind the scenes i never came to you to say this is tc's voice or this is tc's message to me this is why i'm doing this this is why i'm doing it. i have never done that and from then people responded subsequently others went to uh, uh grant him an interview it was after that that the vice president came to his aid and tt and i have kept a relationship since then till date tt sends me voice notes on a regular You've never heard any of them. Titi sends me messages on the regular. You've never seen any of them. I have never come to any of you via social media or personally to say, Titi sends me this, Titi sends me that. No, it's never happened before. Because I respect the relationship I have with him. I respect his privacy. I never do anything public without Titi's consent. Now, back to the conversation that has gone viral. On the 17th of December, I was all the way in Akwaibom in Nigeria when TT dropped the voice note that has gone viral to me. It was a voice note. And I sent him a message saying that uh, I wasn't in town and that when I get back to Ghana, I'll address his issues. I came back to Ghana, I began to ask questions because if you heard that voice note that has gone viral, you will hear that he talks about the vice president's uh, money being invest, uh, invested, yes, and that the I was worried about it because I know his situation. And so I came to Ghana and I began to ask questions. 
And then I reached out to somebody who knows somebody in the office of the vice president to ask questions about what TT's claims are. And this person in the office of the vice president was vividly worried and said, oh, we have redeemed our pledge to him and this is not going to be a good one for the vice president if he gets to hear it or if he goes out there. I remember the words, if he gets out there, it's not going to be a good one for the vice president, blah, 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 blah. How did you get, how did he say it? And we said there was a voice note. He says, can I hear the voice notes? So in confidence, not thinking that anything will be done, but thinking that I will get solution for TT because again, the vice president's office has been mentioned. The greater Accra regional minister has been mentioned. I do not have access to this big wigs in politics. So I thought that sending this voice note to this person in the office of the vice president, we would get some solutions and that's how the voice notes were sent to this person in the office of the vice president now fast forward i hear this voice after days on radio how i'm not the one who leaked it i only sent it to an individual in the office of the vice president he also says he's not sent it to anybody so who leaked the audio Maybe we should start asking questions. Ask those who first published it how they got the audio. Those who have the audio, maybe you should come out and tell us how you got the audio. It is not nice and it's unfair to have people drag me knowing very well that I never shared any audio with any media house. I never shared any audio with any journalist. I never shared any audio with any blog. For crying out loud, I have a YouTube channel. I have blogs I could have published this on. They are not or it is not on any of these. How do I leak a video, uh, a voice note, a private conversation, which you've had over and over, I've had this over and over with Titi. How do I leak this one to the public? I never leaked the voice note. I will never do that. I went to Titi's aid. I've always been there for Titi. If you pick up a phone and call Titi, there's no way Titi will tell you I've been there for him. It's quite sad, appalling, disheartening, heartbreaking. I never leaked a video, a voice note. I will never do a thing like that. So please, let's ask the people who are publishing. Since this person in the office of the vice president says he didn't also leak that conversation, let's ask the people who are publishing if they'll be honorable enough to let us know where they got the voice note from. Maybe then we'll know who finally leaked the voice note. But I, Miss G, God is my witness. Mm. So this is the whole issue. Uh, as as no no no, nature said uh, the audio came out, you know, and between the conversation between TT and Miss G, ah TT eh catch Miss G say so we leftovers kakrebi eh we in the kitchen na on farmano because in normal yet ding amano and he also explained that uh, there are certain people who promised him but they've all withdrawn their promises so in normal yet in normal yet ding pa amano and now. Um, according to him, also, so he received the pledge from the vice president. But the IA investment, investment, also, so I say, or the thirty thousand IA bb, twenty thousand, so so or the IA bb. It's the end right now, dear. And it takes a while for you know, who invest bb. It takes a while for you to you know get the repents out. And this is saying there, me watch you know. Okay, yeah, fair no to in change. That be one. Two, she say no one say a man for bar out say more blasting Miss G say ah na convo wa only Titi enye idie why do you put a private convo that you have with Titi out there and a Miss G in so so ababe Kennedy no or say or no anyo no no leaky audio no adi idie or send him or obi an individual in the office of the vice president and na ni panu so so say anyo no so so no leaky ye so the question here is who leaked the video. And now, who leaked the audio? They say, no, the yeah, she shame the panel. IGP, EBA, on so on so on, go she shame. Yeah, 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 who the panel leaking audio? No, because Titi no so so say we should stop blaming Miss G for leaking the audio because Miss G is so so about because she didn't leak it to any blog, any journalist, nobody. So how did they get out there? Okay, let's put that one aside. Let me talk about Titi's matter now. Mm -hmm. So same way, dear. Um, I remember, quite remember, say last year, um, when this whole issue started, and I was, I went to my boss, and I maybe and say ah, and I even tweeted, and I even put it on Facebook, and I asked, for how long will TT keep on begging people for things? Because it has not been once 
He has not been twice. He has not been thrice. He has not been the fourth time. For how long? And on also so bad. TV so Ebeka say those people who are saying and I this 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 and I nyamin tio muka and I say and I say and I say and I say hey boss Oba legends no so so say ye mauska we give you money too we give plenty of people give money right now me my question here be say the money no where you to you they keep on like that no where you say you they invest them you they do am so 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 how the money no go feel what you, then watch everything to the extent say you go ask somebody for leftovers. Me, I know they understand that side. That be the part where me, I know they understand for once. When me self, I start to think, me, 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 me drink which they say, ah, when you're sure say, obi so so, any titi na mo. Say, ah, we a eh, critical plan. Yeni say, yeni say, yeni say, yeni say. Because, I di asem wedi, me diya menti asye. Titi, boss, who is a veteran actor? Who is a taxi driver? No, me cramp, no, me, sir. All respect to you, sir. That one, dear, no doubt. All respect to you. This is not the first time I will be abwao. This is not the first time I, um, 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 people out there, me, myself, cramp, when we see things like this, cramp, you, you feel for the person. But my question here is to what extent? To what extent would we be having TT coming back on social media or through any means saying that he needs help? That means, say, help now, Onyanosu. So maybe it's not being managed well at the end of the day. Because if you, if you are there and you keep on asking people, you keep on asking people, you become a nuisance to everybody. You become a nuisance. He's fed up. He doesn't want to help you, or she doesn't want to help you at the end of the day. As to who leaked the audio or who no leaked the audio, they say no, the audio no, it is out. And everybody has heard the conversation. Everybody knows what is going on. I don't know whether people want to pursue <laughs> who leaked the video. I think that one, Campo, it doesn't even make sense to me. My thing here is, this is a problem. How can we solve it? This is a problem, and how can we solve it? I, I don't know. I'm asking you to, what do you think about this whole issue? What do you also think about this whole issue? We're a viral case of the week. Because as same way, dear, me, to me, dear, uh, I mean, sometimes, because me, if TT is my uncle, and I see my uncle coming out on social media to keep on begging every single time, I will feel some way. I will definitely feel some way. So I don't know about you. What do you think? Most of my messages, no. Dos on hat, but um she say no dear maybe be phone lines. Maybe be phone lines, maybe ah now so so watch your dream. What dream was saying? Mr. Mo, um please, this one has nothing to do with insults. When I was giving my submission, I didn't insult anybody. So take a cue from it, Mr. Mo Munsia. Mo bien yano. Asem no, asem na aba. Asem no so so better me at all. It can happen to you. It can happen to your uncle. It can happen to your auntie. It can happen to your cousin. It can happen to you personally. But the thing here is, what do you think about this whole issue? If you were in Titi's shoes, how would you have solved this whole issue? Or probably you're close to Titi. How would you solve this whole issue? Because at the end of the day, I to that. I'm saying, yeah, we all we hear. So what do you think? The four lines are on your screens right now. Call me. Hello. 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 Yes, boss. What's your name and where are you calling me from? Hello. Yes, boss. I can hear you. What is your name and where are you calling me from? My name is Pamela Gandhi. Okay. All right. So, Titi's issue, what do you think about it? Um, boss, please, can yeah, you can you switch off? Human, it's part of humanity, so if uh, we should be me. I didn't hear you, please. And this is issue is part of humanity. Mm. So if we have it, we should help him and we should forget other stuff. Uh, his complaints and what he said, we should forget it and we should give him what he needs. Okay, so... Human beings, we are there for each other. Okay. All right. Thank you very much for your submission. Thank you very much for calling. All right, guys, please. Uh, Mr. Mo Ofra, 
Eh, make sure say o o o TV no o TV no volume no faba from kaka. Eh, bring it down. All right? And listen from your phone. Don't listen from the TV. Me nim say money age. Eh. Hello. Hello. Yes boss, patch up with din. I from Howard. Okay, who free? Yeah. I want to comment about the city issue now. All right, go ahead. I'm listening. Yeah, if some somebody is directing the man in the wrong direction, mm. looking at what the man is doing, if some somebody is somewhere directing the man and he himself doesn't know what he's up to. Yeah. Yeah, that is what I can say about okay. the the league for you. Okay. okay. Like somebody is directing the man to just Okay. Do certain things so that they can get money from. Yeah. Others. Okay. All right. So that's Thank my you. On this. Thank you very much for your submission right there. At least somebody is siding with me on this one. All right. Anyways, please the numbers on your screens right now. Please call. Please call. Hello. Hello. Yeah, hello. Yes, please. What's your name and where are you calling me from? I'm here. I'm calling from All right, if you are, please, can you please turn down the volume of your TV oh, set? Okay. Yes, thank you. I think we all get to set up with so we should stop. I didn't get you. Say that again. Oh, I missed the fear right there. Uh, please, when you guys are calling, eh? Uh, make sure you just turn down the volume of your TV set. We're begging you, okay? Turn it down. Turn it down completely so you can clearly hear me and I can hear you. Do I have a caller? Hello? Yeah, hello. Good yes, afternoon. boss. Good afternoon. What's your name and where are you calling me yeah. from? I'm Kwesi from Hanaji. Okay, Kwesi, talk Hanaji. to me. What do you think yeah. about TT's issue? Yeah, I would want to touch on um, TT's um, uh, response. You see, the only, there is something called confidentiality. Mm. But the only time that we bring this confidentiality um, to the friend or whoever is when our name is being dragged into a demand. Yeah. This person at the office of the president, uh, the office of the vice president, mm -hmm. that she should have mentioned his mm -hmm. That would have been it. Mm. Because what she is but because he didn't mention the person's name, okay, how people would doubt. Okay. okay, so I think this is the only aspect I would want to touch. Okay, thank you. All right, thank you very much for your submission.